Okay, guys, in today I'm, I'm going to show you my roll doll book collection. Oh, what's that? A little vest behind me. Okay, roll doll book collection. Now, um, I'm going to do some more videos, try to do about three a month, two, three, maybe even four. But this is my, another, my next video. I did do a video um, recently, and what was that? Um, yeah, I did a video recently on my comic collection. This is my book collection. I just love doing collection videos or reviews. I don't do any juggling videos now because I've learnt you all of them. I might learn some more and show you them. Uh, so we'll start doing those blue money lessons soon. L lots more of those. But I'm concentrating on the next like month or so on collections and reviews. So this is my Roll Doll collection review. And let's get started then. So I am missing... In the collection, I'm missing three books. George's, Mar George's Marvellous Medicine, The Giraffe and the Pelly and Me, and Fantastic Mr Fox. Yes, um, you can get them in all different um, editions. Well, I've got mine on a newish, oldish, a couple of years old edition. And um, I'll show you that edition on here. Um, yeah, this is, um, yeah... Um, yeah, one minute, guys. I'm gonna show you my edition, and I'll type in the twits for you. One minute, guys. Sorry, I just want to show you the um, edition that I've got, and the editions you can get. Okay, that's my edition. Oh, can you see that there, guys? See that edition with the roll doll and the twits? That's my edition of all of my books I love got. Yeah, and you can get other editions like this edition. Oh, even this edition, what's them quite new, very new, I think. I'm um, not as keen on that one, and you can get the older one. That's, that's the oldest one, so there's that one. The ones that I've got, that edition. And there is this new one. What? Um, oh, and there's that that other one. So that they've got that old one. Um, you've got that old one. You've got that old one. That loads of editions sign is that. You've got that also old one. People can uh, and and all of them will be like the same. Could be rolled all in the right at the top and like it's, it'll be exactly the same. And they're all the old ones. And then I've got this newer one, newish ones. I think these are the best ones out of all of them. And the other one is the very new one that I showed you just, and that is the one that I don't like. That one. So they're all all the different editions there are. And my favourite out of all the ones that I just showed you. Isn't that one or none or none of the others? It is that edition of all of them with the big roll doll writing and the stripe in the middle and the stripe at the bottom. Here you go then guys, so let's get started. So I'll just show you all the different editions. So first we've got the magic finger. Um, I really like this book. It's not a uh, um it's not too thick of a book, but um it's more really good one. Um it's not one of my favourites, but it's quite interesting. It's about the magic finger, and um, it's all like magic. But I really do enjoy this one, and it's a good book to read. There's a cover of it. There's magic finger there, and there's a back. And here's characters in it, and all that stuff. And I'll show you a few pages after. The book. Well, that's that book. I really enjoy this book. Um, it's not a brilliant favourite, but it's really interesting and like, good. It's got good imagination. It makes you want to read on more. So I really like that book. And next we've got SEO Trust, another thin book. Um, I really don't like this one. I hate it. It's boring. Just all about a turtle. But I still like to have, to have it. I haven't got rid of it because I want to. I, I like. I like all the Roald Dahl books, but this one I don't like. I just want to get all of them anyway. But it's all right. But I still want to keep it anyway because it's still okay. But it's not very good. 
we've got some good pictures in there. It's not one of my favourites, it's almost thumbs down. A few little bits of it I like, but not overall, I'd, I'd give it not not a very good number, but at least I've got it anyway. I'll just have it anyway, and I might as well keep it because I like it a little bit. And there's the back of it, and there's the front of it. SEO truck stands for tortoise backwards, tortoise, and there's a tortoise, and there's the people who own it, and it's just like a really good book, I'll show you some pictures of it. I think it's got some really good pictures in it though. Tortoise and everything. There, yeah, guys. So that's the SEO trot. And then next, we've got the Twix. This is my third favourite out of them all. Uh, I do really like this one. This one's a slight bit thicker than these two. The, the short, the, the non thickest one is this one out of the ones that I've got. And then the next one's that one that's a bit thicker. But this one is a little bit thicker than the SEO trot. Yeah, but this is really good. I love this one. It's really funny. They play tricks on each other. It's not my favourite as my other two, but I really do like this one. This is like in my top three. It's my third. And I'll show you some pictures out of it. There's the front of it with them both standing the wrong way around. And there's the back of it. It tells you, tells you all stuff to do. Eyeballs and drinks, frogs in beds, worms and spaghetti. There's side doors have a stripe on the side like that with the back there and the puffin there and then the right on the top the stripe there and the stripe there with the puffin badge there and the little picture there. And always a big right at the top any colour. Yeah guys, so um I'll show you some picture of this one. This is one of my favourites. I really like this one. Love this one. It's really interesting, funny. You wanna read on, it makes just a really good book. Play some good tricks on each other though, they do. You're in bed, glass eye, dirty beards, and all that stuff. And it says it shows the characters at the front as well. Oh, sorry guys, I didn't show, show, show you the front part of SEO Trot, the characters. There's the characters on that one. Oh, I didn't show you that very good at all, did I? I'll show you the characters of SEO Trot, the pet owner, the tortoise. Mr. Hobbo and all that, and it's got like a, the tortoise catcher. What well, isn't a character, but still put that there. Anyway, guys, well, I think, um, yeah, this the next one is Jazz and Giant Peas. I just thought I will do another, I'll probably do a video on my Halloween decorations in my room because I decorate my room in all Halloween stuff. Yeah, so I'll show you that, guys. Halloween room decorated room okay next we've got jabs and giant peas this is quite good I really like this one so this is my fifth favourite or something like that I don't know but I've read my name on this one is that my writing I just thought I don't know who's read that one looks like Bradley's writing I think Bradley's written on that one yeah, my friend basically. Um, yeah, the front of it. Um, I really like this one. So this is my fifth, sixth favorite. Favorite, I'll say fifth. And at the end, I'll show you all my favorites in order. But I really like this one. Not so right. It's not not many pictures in this one. There's more writing because you see the thicker. That's even thicker than the Twix book. How much writing there is on those pages, man. This is where the books start getting a bit thicker. Um, I don't think the pictures are very good on this. They're alright, but they're not the best. And in this pack, I've got the people. Yeah. Well, that's that one, and the, there's the back of it with all the stuff it tells you, like earwigs cooked in slime, jelly gnats, all that stuff there. There's a stripe as usual, with the blurb, right at the top stripe with the title. And every book of, of my edition collection, it says the world's number one storyteller, and it tells you the illustrator on the bottom question by good illustrator, 
and there's a giant peach and everything on there. I really quite like this book actually. Put that over there with all the rest. I'm trying to make this a bit neat. I've got a little pole around here as well. What you can't see. Okay, next we've got um, Charlie and the Great Glass of Devices. This is the second one. Um, I haven't read this one, so I can't say anything about it. But um, there's not a film of this for some reason. Um, but on that one, they've got a film of. But this is this one. It's, I like the cover. It's like, I like if you're in spice. I love the cover. I like that and all that on the front. Charge all the stuff, blurb, funny pictures there, a few characters, shows you the characters in the front, but this hasn't been read so you might tell that the pages are very tight together and they're not like if you're open, they're not like really wide, it's like closed together because I haven't even used it. But I'll try to show you the pictures without making them go too open. Um, quite a weird one, this looks quite quite interesting and like um different to all the rest but um i've had some people say i, I don't think it's it's as good as the first one but it looks quite interesting and different and like spicified if that's the word like so they've got a skyscraper there and all that as i say it's a really interesting looks really interesting and good i think it does but yeah that's that one i ever showed you the picture on the front Oh, more or less all the same people. Not all of them. No, we've got a few different people. Those two weren't on the other one, and those weren't. The only same characters are the main ones, those three. And all the rest, and all the rest have gone. But all of the rest are in this book. This is the first Child of the Chocolate Factory book. I'll say this is like that one. I'll, I can't say, but um, yeah, Jan's a Giant Beach is my sick favourite. I'll say this is. Probably my fifth favourite man. Yeah, my fifth favourite. Yeah, Child and Chocolate Factory. There you go. Yellow cover. All the stuff on the front as usual. The factory there. On the back. All the stuff. Blurb. Picture, picture, picture. Red stripe. Where you write your name. Um, yeah. I really like this book. This is really good. Really, um... I don't know, it's hard to describe, but I just really like it. This is my, I'd say, fifth favourite. Can't describe it in any way. It's just, you want to read on it. It's just, like, really good, I think. There's not that many pictures in this one. A little poem there. It's a long book. It's, this is even thicker. I don't know, they're about the same, actually. There's a little people there. There you go. Okay then, guys. That's that one. Really like this one, though, guys. So I prefer... I don't prefer it as much as the Twits, but I'd love that one. I'll add that onto my pile. And next, have a guess what we've got. The BFG, the Big Friendly Giant, in other words. Uh, the cover on this. This is my fourth favourite. I just... Oh, tied you into another world. You just, I just absolutely adore this one. I never want this one to get ripped off. I just really like it, basically. There's the back of all the same stuff. Front. Characters. Good characters and good description and everything. And it's quite peculiar and weird and... Well descriptive and he's like he can't talk and he's learned and he's, he meets his little girl named Sophie but I just really do like this book. Got some nice pictures in this book, really interesting and kind of funny and kind of like make friends and they have a lot of fun together. Basically guys and yeah. So that is those pictures on that one then. And always on the back on every single book it shows you all about Roll Doll, his favourite colour and all that stuff and his signature and favourite music, birthday, colour of eyes, colour of hair, favourite food, funniest moment, all of that stuff and it shows you a bit about all his books and websites you can go on to at the back, a few pages like that. That's a BFG, a well adored book.
this one sorry i can't describe um but it looks a bit boring to me i don't think i'll enjoy this one this is more adulty for uh, i won't recommend this as much for children it looks a bit boring for me and yeah it looks a bit boring for me but there it is anyway there's the back Spying. I'm not going to show you the pictures, probably not on this book. Has it got any characters in it? Show you the characters in the book now. Has it got no characters to show? But as, as you can see, I'll show you now all the stuff it's got in it. I've got any pictures, bits and bobs like that. Got like pictures of actual people and where they lived in the moved houses and like. Tales of childhood and how he went on the boat with all of the children. And all. It's more for adulty, adulty book. But there you go. I'll give that one out of how many books. I'll give out of my twelve. I'll give this my eleventh favorite because going solo is probably my twelfth because it's a bit more. Um, Worse. I don't enjoy that one as much, but this one is more interesting than this one. I just like to have a little read of that. But this one, I'll, I still have a read of, but I'm not overly keen on that one. Um, yeah, so this is going going solo. I showed you that one. Next, we've got going solo. And I read this one. It wasn't really good. I didn't like it that much. It was okay, but I still keep it because I like it and I like to have a nice collection. Now it's basically because I still like parts of it. I look, I look at the pictures. I've read it. It's just, um, I like it, it's just not my, one of my good favourites, it's just okay in the middle, but it's alright, I'm not too bad about it. It was a bit boring, like, like the boy one again, boy tales of childhood, and it didn't, I'm not gonna, there's not many pictures in this book. It looks like little pictures of people there and everything, and there's like, warships and everything, I don't know, what is it? It's like a little... Horse. Yeah, there's not many pictures to show them in this book. Yeah, but up there. Whoops. And then next we have got, I'd say, my seventh favourite Danny the Champion of the World. I really like this one. Quite enjoyable. Um, gets a bit bored at times, but I like it. I like it. Like it, man. Um, I do read this quite a lot, and there you go, so there's the front, as usual, with all the stuff, and there's the front, the blurb, stuff about it, stripe, picture, I'll show the people in the front, but I do really enjoy this one, and adore this one quite a lot, but not too much, because it's only my seventh favourite, out of all of them, and I'll show you a few pictures, I've got that picture, you've got that picture, um, picture there, picture there, there's quite a lot of pictures in this one. I like the story. I, I, I like it's like kind of like an adventure one. I like I do like the adventure ones. Quite like this book. It's got a good adventure in it about the boy and his dad. They kind of find each other. This video is getting long now. I'll try to end it before it hits twenty one minutes, guys. And there's another picture there. A picture there. And there. The pictures and stuff like that there guys and got the contents in the front and uh, as usual on the back it's got Roald Dahl's history and like a website you can learn all about his books and yeah the, out of this edition it's not just says what, what what I'm missing the enormous crocodile they do in this edition and also in this edition they do do one more and that's the joke book I might get that one no, and the poem book they also do so I'm missing quite a few, but I might not get those. But I've got the main ones, and, and the other couple are the main ones. These are all of them, guys. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm missing a few of those. Yeah, it's got some pictures in here, but... I really like this book, though. I don't know what I'd give that one year, probably. I've already told you, and I'm not sure. But next, we've got The Witches. 
Um, I really like this one. I'd give this one my sixth favourite. I don't know. I'm not. I'm going to tell you the age, but I like this one. Not brilliant, but it's quite interesting. Um, but, um, the witches, yeah. It's quite freaky and like Halloween vibe. As you see, we've got some nice pictures in here. Lots of nice pictures. Uh, yeah, guys. And then last but not least, we've got Matilda. And there's the front. There's the back. I didn't show the front and the back, front and back of that one, and I'll show the front and the back of that one. Um, I can't believe this, but I've heard about it, but I haven't actually read this one. But never mind. Um, front, people in it as usual. Um, shows you some of his books in the back, all about his family and all that. I'll show you a couple of pictures and see I'll, I'll end it in a minute guys I just want to show you what my books and everything there, there's a picture so that's all of my books I've got so far in, in my collections only a few more to go and I'll show them in my order of my first out of the 12 I've got one two Yeah, I've got 12 books. I'll show you my first 12. Okay, so uh, my number one favourite is definitely the BFG. So that's my first favourite. Second favourite is the Twits. Third favourite is Charlie and the Chocolate Factory. Fourth favourite is... James and the Giant Peach. Fifth favourite is probably Danny the Champion of the World. This one, Danny the Champion of the World. That's my fifth. I'll say my sixth is the Magic Finger. My seventh is. I'm not going to add that one because I don't know. I'm not going to add that one because I don't know. Um, and uh, my seventh favourite is the Witches. My favourite is SEO Trot and my ninth favourite is the boy boy tales of childhood and my last favourite is my last one out of all is going solo. Yeah guys that's all of them and these two I can't add in because I haven't read them sadly. But never mind, I've just read all this. So thanks for watching guys. Please write, comment, and subscribe if you try to do more videos. And that's my Rod Doll collection so far. And there's only a few more I need to go. And they always do all of them in each different editions. But I haven't got the others what are in all the editions, you know what I mean? So that's it then guys, see ya. Thanks for watching. That's all of it guys. My next video will definitely month I promise that my next video will be a blue modernist video. And bye, hope you enjoyed it, subscribe to my channel, all that stuff, like and all that. See ya, and this is my Roll Doll Collection video, bye!